Good afternoon from Thailand. Today I will be going to a place I've always wanted to go but never had a chance to go. Asia Teak, which is an open air market. Now to get there, there's not really an easy path. So what I'm gonna do now is get on the BTS. I'm gonna take the BTS to Siam. Then I'm gonna take the Siloam line, which is, I believe, I don't know if it's a BTS or MRT, or, um, MRT underground, but I'm gonna take the Silo line line to the last available stop prior to the ferry. So BTS, Siloam line, then we're gonna get on a boat and take that for 10 minutes to Asia Teak. So let's go guys. You can see where I'm staying here. Tons of street food, always. Pretty nice place. I'm gonna do a video on where I'm staying in the future for you guys. All right, I am staying in Phnom Penh, so I'm going to start the BTS journey here, take it to Siloam, and it is 3.46, so I will let you know how long this takes. I think it's gonna be about 50 minutes at least. Oh, are we gonna make it, guys? Are we gonna make it? Oh, I don't think so. Oh, let's see here. craziest metro stations. We're gonna go to the Sea Loam line up here. It is prime time, people getting off work and etc. So, you know, I only got my cart to uh, here, so I'm probably gonna get dinged if I try to, I might have to go out, get another cart, go back in. We'll see what happens. All right, Bangwa. Hopefully I can just pay when I get off at the station. Okay, we're gonna ride it to Sapan Taskin and get on the uh, boat from there, right there. All right, let's see here. That took uh, 15, 25, is that right? No, 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 35, 35 minutes. So now I gotta get on a boat. All right, I just had to pay 12 baht extra to get off here. Now I'm just picking an exit and let's see what we can find, guys. All right, I'm just gonna walk towards the water. Hopefully there will be a ferry there. There should be a special Asia Teak ferry from what I read. Oh, Sathorn Pier, perfect, okay. All right, now the question is where do we go? This ferry or this ferry? I'm sure someone will help me. Because there's one over there, but there's also one over here. I don't know. Well, maybe this map will help me. Oh, you can even take this to Icon Siam. Maybe we go there. Uh, hello. Okay, we're looking to go to Asia Teak. What can I do? Uh, I want to go to Asia Teak. Going for motorbike? No, Asia Teak. Asia Teak go here. Go o there. Over here? Kap. Okay. Kapung Kap, thank you. Kapung. Oh, there's even a uh, another map here. Sathorn, Asia Teak. Okay. Alright, 30 bucks. Cup and pop. Which way do I go? This way? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Okay, okay cup and cup. Alright, well, as always, people are very friendly here and you'll get it sorted out. 30 baht is uh, less than a dollar. Let's take this. Looks like we might get on that one. Hmm, maybe we take uh, a Khan Siam from here. That would be kind of cool. Looks like we'll be taking that. Pretty sick boat, guys. Very quickly. 
Alright, we have arrived. For choosing our service. Alright. Alright, for those of you who are curious, let's see how long that took. 50 minutes exactly. So it started at 346 and it is 436, so 50 minutes exactly. Alright guys, we're gonna eat some nice food and see what this is all about. All right, where do we start? I guess we'll just start walking here. Apparently there are a bunch of sections to this market. And I cannot describe to you how hungry I am. It is 4.36, I've had basically nothing. Hmm. Orange juice, oh, 200 baht. Wow, it's an expensive orange juice in Thailand. It's like $6. Or five. Okay, looks like we have like an arcade here. Let's just take a dip in here. What's in here? A warehouse. Ah, oh, music. This is like a simulation. We've got these awesome crane games in here. It's like uh, maybe One Piece stuff. Okay, warehouse seven through eight. So there's a bunch of these different like pods here. There should be like open air food market, which is really what I'm looking for. If not, there are a bunch of restaurants here we'll eat at. But this is apparently a really nice place at night. I wanted to try to time it for sundown, but maybe I was a little bit off on that. So yeah, see, here's this, uh, uh, what, what is this called? Ferris wheel, Chang. I might be going on that tonight. Warehouse 6, food. Uh, and here's a bunch of food stalls. Like that. Hot sale. 20 bots. Fresh from the garden from Chiang Mai. Hello, cup and cup. Uh, so, sorry, it's already cup. I'll do uh, one. Uh, okay. Cup and cup, thank you. 80 baht for this. Cup and cup, thank you. Really, really fresh orange juice. Mm. Yes, sir. Oh, we've got mango sticky rice and coconut ice cream. Maybe that's dessert later. Oh, the Changs are tempting me, guys. But I'm currently going no alcohol, so. I've seen this before, spicy pork back bone soup. Hello. Really good looking skewers there. Oh, what's in here? More stuff. Push to open. Oh wow, this is sick, guys. More food places in here. Let's see, I don't know what to decide. I never know what to decide when I come to these markets. This one's a bit of a different one. It's not just food. It's a whole bunch of stuff. Pork tenderloin, pork tendon meatball. Oh wow, unique. Oh, let's give this a shot. Hello, sweaty girl. Uh, what is the best? What is the best one? Beef. Beef. Uh, beef. Okay. Uh, one. One. That looks like it comes with some veggies too. We'll be eating those. Uh, it's okay, it's okay. Thank you. Cup and cup. Alright, let's try this. 
beef meatball. Mmm. It's got the spicy Thai sauce on it. I don't know what. You can end on a foot massage here if you want. Also got currency exchanges all throughout here. I've seen a few actually. And a bunch of trash cans, which you guys know I am absolutely neurotic about. I like to throw my trash away. Oh, look. Just came from Japan. Shibuya honey toast. Oh, I'm sure that's incredible. Mm, I think I want to get some of that pork backbone soup while I'm here. I've never had a chance to try it. You know what? Let's just go for it. Now as good a time as ever. Hello, sweaty cop. Uh, spicy pork backbone soup? Okay, spicy. Spicy, okay. okay. Alright, guys, let's try this. So, you may have seen this online, I certainly have, but it's like a famous dish here. Putting the soup in there. Ooh. You better go grab a seat. Okay, I will sit here. Okay, thank you. Ah, stress and spicy pork backbone soup, guys. Sadly, there's music playing, so I'll try to get as much as I can or do a voiceover. Thank you. Look at this. Oh my god. How do I eat this? I have a glove here. <clears throat> do I eat it with the glove? At 250, it's quite affordable. It's only about seven bucks or something. Do I uh, do I eat with my hands? Uh, no, uh, with my hands. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you. All right. Let's try some of this broth first. Oh boy. Oh boy, that broth is so good. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my gosh, that is so flavorful and juicy. Let me switch gloves here because I can only use a chopstick with my right hand. That is so flavorful and juicy, it's insane. Oh my god. Let's get some of the veg. I believe it's cilantro in there. Onion, cilantro, um, tomatoes, chilies. And the soup is legitimately spicy too. Oh, this is must try. Oh my god, so good. Okay guys, well I would say you've got to try spicy pork backbone soup. The only thing I can compare it to is it's like baby back ribs in America. It's just like fall off the bone, fall off the rib, pork. Yeah, it's like baby back ribs. You even kind of eat it with your hands. Oh, it was insanely good. I couldn't capture a ton of it, but yeah, it was getting really hot. Like, like really actually like hot outside. And uh, I want to eat more, so I didn't eat most of it. I ate, of course, quite a bit, but not all of it, maybe half of it. So, let's continue. All right, I tipped inside. We have all sorts of souvenirs. Uh, I got anime baubles here. Hello, hello, hello. Oh well, guys, I think it is dessert time. Yeah, it's dessert time. Nice water fountain here in the middle. Paradise, Thailand. Let's go get a good dessert. See like fruits and stuff over here. I want like a really unhealthy dessert. Wait, I think back there, didn't I see? Oh, oh, vegetable spring roll. Vegetable spring roll, fried chicken cheese, cheese ball. Chicken goiza, gyoza. Oh man, I should've came here. Scorpions. Let's 
Hello. Uh, one coconut? Uh, cold? Okay. Sorts of coconuts here. Okay, I'll give this to you. Coffee cup. Thank you. Kapu mm. Kapu, thank you. Mm. Guys, it has been too long since I've had a Thai coconut. Cannot be matched. All right, now I'm forgetting exactly. I think I came through here on that end. I think I saw like some desserts and stuff, but all sorts of uh, souvenirs. Oh, you gotta get one of these. These are so good, nasal inhalers. You don't eat them, guys, but you inhale them. And sort of like a Vicks vapor rub, but it's so good. Makes you feel really nice. Okay, and you have formal sit-down restaurants all throughout here as well. A candy shop here. Guys, I don't exactly know what dessert I'm on the hunt for, but I know I'm on the hunt for some dessert that is in my subconscious that I walked by. I know I saw it. I think it's like probably an ice cream or something like that. I don't exactly remember where it was, but I've been walking around here trying to find it. Uh, I think that's where I ate. Maybe it's down here. Okay, that's where I got orange juice at the beginning of this eating session. Ah, oh, this is it. Yep, yep, this is it. The colors are from natural resources. Yeah. Hello, sweaty cop. Uh, mango with seven colors? Yes. Okay. One. Ah, uh, one please, yes. Uh, Tower cup? 150? Yeah, 150. Okay. Oh, look at all this. Okay, cup and cup. Thank you. Have a good day, guys. Thank you, cup and cup. All right. Let's find a place that doesn't have music to eat this. Let's use an expletive. It's just the music, guys. do this okay well first I just gotta say this is an intense mango sticky rice looks like you got a full mango here with all these different flavor or colored uh, rices Wow well I'm gonna take a photo for Instagram here so I had one of these in December let's dig in just a few months ago oh, wait no it's April so that would have been four months ago I wonder if each of the rices tastes different. Or if it's just coloring. Hmm, can't tell. But mango sticky rice ranks on one of my top desserts in the world. I love mangoes just anyway. But when you add the coconut milk, the little crisps in the rice, can't be beat. Okay, well, I went from completely hungry to completely full in not a long time, so mission accomplished. All right, let's see what else is around here. Now I know why vloggers don't come here. There's music literally everywhere. I mean, I think I've seen some videos online of it, but this isn't like a huge, like, oh, you gotta do this in Bangkok. It's cool though, it's really cool. Well, I think I know how to pass the time. I think it's time for a foot massage. Let's see how much they are. Hello, sweaty cop. Uh, foot massage? 30 minutes. 30 minutes. Okay, that was the first time I got massaged by a dude, actually. I don't know how to feel about that. It was also 100 baht extra compared to the other half hour foot massages. But you know what? It is what it is, guys. It's starting to get a little bit darker here. Ah, my feet do feel nice and refreshed, I will tell you that much. I actually hate heights. Some of you know this, but I feel like you have to do it. We're gonna do it. Oh, here we go. 
Oh wait, should I even do it? There's music playing. All right, 500 baht, music blaring. I don't even really want to do it. We're not doing it. Let's go somewhere else. Oh wow, doesn't this look sick? It's Crystal Grill House. Sit in there, have a beer, have some food. We got the sun here coming down. You can see it. It's amazing looking. All right, well, should you put this on your Bangkok to-do list? Hmm, I'm on the fence on recommending it. I think if you have a family, absolutely. Absolutely you should. But, yeah, that's, that's kind of my take. Fun experience, I wanted to do it for a month, for a year now. It's now one year since I've been in Bangkok, over a year, 14 months, and I just never got to do it. So, we got this awesome skyline view. I'll be sure to take a photo for Instagram. And I also ask you to kindly hit subscribe, really helps the channel grow, helps me continue making these videos. Thank you. All right, we're gonna get on this free boat. I think it takes us back to Sathorn Pier. Ah, the sky is just, it's worth it to come see it at this time, I think. Alright, I can't see arms over there. It's like a 17 minute walk or a 10 minute boat ride. Hmm. I wonder if that's the boat that goes over there. Wow, look at the line to get over to uh, Asia Teak now. I think I might just walk. It would be good for me. All right, we're just gonna walk, I guess. Unless I can get on the boat here. I mean, it's right there. It's that glowing building. Let's go over there. All right, well, this is uh, picturesque, guys. Killing my uh, fear of heights here. One day at a time. Oh, wow, look at that. Guys, there's always something to discover new here in Bangkok. This is why I always recommend wherever country you go to, you should walk as much as you can because you just see new and interesting things. And this is a section I've never been to, I've never walked around. I have been to Icon Siam before, but I always take a grab. And if I'm not mistaken, I think there's a new like yellow line or gold line that runs near here. I might be able to take it back. But let's check out Icon Siam. All right, we have arrived here. Let's cool off in the good old Icon Siam. Oh, I think I went the wrong way. I think it's been a year since I've been here. It's kind of out of the way, you know. Maybe this is the new BTS station. Oh, that'd be sick. All these tuk-tuks. If I'm not mistaken, this is the mall that has a bunch of like indoor street food. Yeah, I think this is it. I think it's Tuesday. Wow. Busy, seven o'clock. Check out River Park and Icon Fountain here. You obviously just saw me eat a ton of food, so I'm really good on that. But maybe a drink, maybe a smoothie. We'll see you guys. When in Thailand. Oh sweet, yes, pre-Songkran. So this is the main reason I'm in Thailand this time, is to experience Songkran. Last year I missed it by like a week or two. Let's see what this Songkran, Maha Songkran Festival World Water. Oh, here's the thing I just bought, the spicy pork backbone soup. I guess there are so many places you can get that. That is a top, top dish. It's 280, I got mine for 250 over at Asia Teak but well worth it. Boy guys, I know Asia is a big continent, but everywhere I've been in Asia lately has just been so crowded, which is a good thing, because it means so many tourists are interested in coming here, myself included. But like, it seems 
busier than a year ago when I was traveling through Asia. Again, I think this is a good thing, but just be prepared. I mean, if you come out to Thailand, Japan, Korea, all the other places, so busy. All right, there we are on the big screen, guys. My Chang mineral water. And it says, uh, hello. And it says, um, this is going on all throughout April 1st to April 18th. Water festival. Alright, let's check out the veranda. I'll just take a look at the design here on the ceiling. Oh, you can get some really nice food here. Okay. I really want to see the, um, let's see here. It said something about like a, is that the fountain? I don't know. Oh, you know what? I think I was here before. Let's just keep walking. No, that's not it. It's cool nonetheless. Yeah, I was here before. I got something at Bricks a year ago. Okay, this is what I'm looking for. The veranda, oh wait, no, River Park and Icon Fountain. Maybe that was the Icon Fountain, because I was just in the veranda. Wow, look how beautiful this mall is. This is one of the nicest malls in the world, guys. Okay, yeah, the Icon Fountain was definitely down there. Cool. Blue Alan Ducasse. Wow, that restaurant looks insane. Okay, there's a Maserati shop over here. I really want to see it. Look at this amethyst. Oh my god. Look at that amethyst. Oh, that one sold. Wow. Maserati, just a casual Maserati chilling here in the uh, Icon Siam Mall. Wow. I think probably 300 to 500,000 USD for one of these, something like that. Oh, they take Visa guys, so just in case. You want to pay with Visa? Oh, casual Porsche here, just chilling. Get my influencer picture in a Porsche. <laughs> this percent coffee, you can find it all over Asia, is incredible. Definitely gonna pay up, but like, look at this design of this shop, guys. Just the aesthetic of this shop is unbelievably cool. This is the coolest one I think I've seen. I've gone to a bunch of these all over Asia from Japan, Philippines, South Korea, Thailand. I don't know if there's one in Vietnam, but it's, yeah, good coffee. I think a bit overpriced for what it is, but you should go. All right, so I'm not going to refilm this because I've been in here, but this Apple store is insane. I'm going to go through the Apple store and show you what is on out the outside of the Apple store. Also, one of the best Apple stores I've ever been to in my life, without, without question. This Apple store is wild. So through the Apple store here, you have a, like a terrace. Let me show you. Wild, absolutely wild. Oh, and look, and there's kites being flown up here. That's incredible. Yeah, you get an amazing view of the Bangkok skyline. Uh, skyline, oh my gosh. Words. Okay, let's try taking this gold line. I think this is new. All right, some friendly staff told me it's actually just right here. 
so let's go. Wow, this is exciting, guys. Now I think I can say I've been on just about every line, I think. Oh, this is, that does look super new. I wonder if I can go right to Phnom Penh. Or I might go to a soak and walk back. Oh no. Okay. We're gonna go to this one. 16 baht. Oh, the card is even gold. The gold line. Krung Tonbury. Okay. So we're gonna go to Krung Tonbury. Cool. Platform two. Nice and fresh look, guys. New. Very cool. Here it is, coming. Just in time. Oh, it's small. This is super convenient. Look at this. Looks way different. Please mind the gap between train and platform. Thank you. It's very like almost like a tram. It actually wasn't a super short ride. Definitely worth it. I was like, why is it 16 baht? Because I think it's like one stop, like on a normal BTS line. It's a bit cheaper. Maybe I'm wrong, but I think that's convenient. Alright. Let's see where we go from here. Alright, and truthfully, I don't know where I am, so let's just go to the BTS SkyTrain. I have not been to this part of Bangkok. Yeah, we're definitely out there. Alright, so we're gonna ride to Siam and then go to a soap. Alright guys, well with that, I think I end this amazing day here in Bangkok. Another amazing day here in Thailand. Thank you so much for being here and I'm most certainly be talking to you again soon. Peace. Yeah, yeah, do that.